this is lesson number 11 from Learn Romanian with Vlad, uh, Romanian phrases. So let's get started. Today's lesson will be about um, computers and internet in general, uh, things related to it, of course. So let's start with um, the first word uh, is calculator. Computer means computer. Uh, in English and in Romanian, calculator. That means the personal PC, personal computer. Yeah, um, and the same word calculator, uh, you can say is the same to the uh, mini computer, mini calculator um, for doing math. You know, like uh, squared or something. You, you can you can uh, do uh, mini calculations on on it. It's like this portable device. Um, then. Limbaj de programare. That's the programming language as in general, uh, not one in particular. So all the operating systems work on, they are created with uh, um, uh, programming language. Toate programele, toate uh, sistemele de operare sunt create cu limbaj de programare. Python, C++, C Sharp, um, you know, Fox Pro and so on. Now, keyboard. Tastatura, tastatura, and the buttons themselves they are taste. Um, I'm pressing the button on the key. Um, I'm pressing with the finger on the key, on the keyboard. Um, so the keys are taste, and the keyboard is tastatura, and mouse is mouse. Um, though in in shops, if you want to buy a mouse. You, they write it in usually in English, so it's very rare actually when they write it mouse, um, because it's just really not not used. But um, tastatura keyboard, that's that's for sure. Um, so if you want to, you know, buy a new computer, you know what to ask for. You want, um, you know, monitor, ecran, a computer screen, display, so you can see what you're doing, and keyboard and mouse. And of course, uh, now it's a little more detailed, maybe it's not really necessary, but it's good to, to know these words. So motherboard is the place in the computer where all the you know memory chips and CPUs are, are living. Um, they is called placa de base. Placa de base is like base uh, board. Uh, and then you have the video card and the audio card. So placa video, placa audio. And you know the the brands Nvidia whatever, unitate um, centrale and the the whole the main computer unit like I wrote here main computer unit unit sorry uh, is without the screen so it's just this big box um, where all the things are inside it's called unitate centrale unitate centrale so you can say for example uh, you want to go to a shop and you say um, I need uh, you know a, a main computer unit and Unitate centrale and uh, monitor and with a keyboard and mouse and that's it you're you're good to go. Connexione internet. Um, so you you should be online internet connection. So you when you have the computer and you want to connect to the internet and maybe play games or something online, uh, you need uh, in, an internet connection. I never heard of connexione de la internet. Connexione internet. Uh, and in order for that to work, you have to use a cable, a cable de rețea, network cable. So it's the standard white one. Um, so uh, cable de rețea. Cable means cable and rețea means network rețea. Um, rețele de socializare, um, social networks, like Facebook, for example. Uh, pagina de internet, web page. Paginize page of internet of web page. It's pretty straightforward. Now, system de operare. These are uh, operating systems um, like Windows, Linux, um, AIX, and so on, um, or Mac OS. Uh, now, server, virtual server, server, um, server virtual. Uh, I, this is because server itself is the, um, hmm, like how to call it, it's like a, a bigger computer, uh, which like a big imagine a big computer containing more computers inside, or at least the power of more computers. Um, and the virtual server is the one which you can access remotely from any part of the world. World um, server virtual. 
And now some uh, phrases with, uh, with these words or other. Băiatul a primit în dar un calculator nou. The boy received a gift, as a gift, a new computer. Băiatul a primit, received, în dar, as a gift, un calculator nou. A new computer. Nu mai sta atât pe internet. Maybe your parents will tell you this. Um, don't stay so much on, on the internet. Basically, online. Go, you know, go outside and see some, some trees. Um, dacă lucrezi în IT, probabil ai un laptop. If you work in IT, as a IT uh, department, for example, uh, you probably have a, lap, a notebook, a laptop. Cât costă o tastatură nouă? How much is a new keyboard? When you go to the shop and you want to buy a new keyboard and you ask how much is a new keyboard? Cât costă o tastatură nouă? Calculatorul este foarte încet. This may happen to you if you have an old computer. The computer is very slow. It's very slow means um, all the processes, everything that you're doing is like, it takes some time. It has a delay. So you can say that este foarte încet. It's like slow. Of course, the computer doesn't go anywhere, so it's not really fast or slow, but the the um, how it calculates things, how it uh, the response time is, is very slow. So you can say, usually, it the computer itself is slow. Calculatorul este foarte încet. Let's upgrade it. Fără antivirus, nu ești protejat. This, um, yeah, uh, honestly, I think even without, without antivirus, you're not protected. But anyway, um, without antivirus, you are not protected. Fără antivirus, nu ești protejat. And this is like maybe, you know, a good advice to, to buy an antivirus. Uh, am o placă video performantă. I have a performant, very, very powerful video card, very fast. This is processing, uh, I don't know, 50 million uh, triangles per second or something. Uh, you can run some benchmarks and you can see exactly how fast it is. Um, totul în casă e fără fir. Uh, everything in the house is wireless. It's, it's cable-less. It's basically uh, like the modem. You, you get uh, the internet on your the phone like through the air, through uh, radio waves. So it's wireless. This is basically the keyword, wireless, uh, for a fear. And the third page, am schimbat parola la administrator. Uh, I changed the administrator's password. So when you log in, usually it's a, a, a password, username, username and password. Um, so username is um, uh, numele userului, să zicem, um, at utilizatorului, and the Password is called parola. Parola. Am schimbat, I changed the password of administrator, la administrator, for the administrator. Uh, te rog, deblochează-mi contul. Please unlock my account. Deblochează-mi. Unlock uh, free the, the account. Contul account. Apasă pe icoana asta. Click on that icon. So you, you have, you know, let's say Windows installed and you want to open some Uh, program and uh, you say to someone please uh, click on that icon to open it. Te rog apasă pe icoana asta. Nu mai am spațiu pe disc. I don't have space on the disc. Nu mai am spațiu. I don't have space. You can say as well not just for the disc but you can say I don't have space in the room. Nu mai am spațiu în cameră. I don't have space on the disc. Nu mai am spațiu pe disc. Disc means the hard drive, the computer where, where the, all the information is stored. So you can say that, um, I, you know, I, I have so many uh, movies uh, that I don't have free space for anything. So let's, let's clean it up. Now this is, mm, yeah, uh, Viteza dial-up. Um, dial-up speed, basically. It, it means it's like from the past when you're connecting through a modem, uh, through the phone lines. So it was taking... Um, ages to, to do anything online. Um, so you can say, for example, if it is a dial-up, uh, it's like um, very, very slow. That's, that's, this is what it means. Dial-up because you had to actually dial a number and you're connecting through that phone line. Um, jocuri pe calculator, computer games. This is pretty strong, uh, straightforward. Jocuri, co games, uh, computer, on computer. Commando online. Yeah, this is more recent. Um, you can order literally anything online, from foods to, to fridges and so on. Um, 
online orders, basically. Uh, comanda online. Am făcut o comandă online la haine. Uh, I made an online order for uh, clothes. On the internet, obviously. Online means online the internet. On internet line. Am o eroare pe ecran. I have an error on the screen. Like blue screen of death, for example. Uh, am o eroare. I have an error on the screen. So it's like a computer error on the screen. Displayed on the screen. Administrator de sistem. This is a sysadmin, uh, is the system administrator. Um, if you work in a company, usually there is uh, someone who, who takes care of your computers or of the network and so on. So it, this is this guy or girl. Toate fișierele sunt la gunoi. All files um, are in uh, the re- recycle bin. So basically on the desktop is usually a, a, like an icon with, um, you know, recycle bin is called uh, in English. Um, So it's like a garbage bin. It looks like a garbage bin. So you can throw all the all the things that you don't need, like programs or files and so on, um, in that place, and you just clean it, and the computer uh, is uh, empty now. So anyway, this is it for today. This is uh, lesson number eleven for for uh, computer related things. Uh, I really hope you enjoyed it, and I'm hope even more that uh, you find it useful. So thank you very much, and see you later. Bye bye. Hello guys, this is lesson number 12 from um, Romanian Phrases, Learn Romanian with Vlad. So let's get started. Uh, today's lesson is about fruits. And next one will be about uh, vegetables. But anyway, today we have fruits. It's summer and we have a lot of them out there. So let's start with the first fruit. First is măr. Măr. It means apple. Um, You know, it's a famous um, Romanian phrase. Uh, one of the first things that you learn is uh, Ana are mere. Anne, and Anna has apples, but I chose a different one. Am ales un măr din copac. I chose an apple from the tree. So, am ales un măr din copac. Copac is tree and măr is, well, apple, like it's written here. Um, it's one of the most common uh, Romanian Uh, fruits uh, they're growing literally everywhere and um, it's good to know this word apple mar plac merele this is the plural mere strugure grape um, especially in autumn we have a lot of wine and of course wine is made out of grapes el a făcut vin din struguri he made wine from grapes we have of course grapes um, green and uh, dark you can make uh, white wine or red wine then you have uh, pruna is plum din copac a căzut o pruna again copac because yeah they're fruit so they grow in the tree majority of them and um, you know from the tree fell a plum pruna plum also in summer we have watermelon um, we have two types usually Uh, pepene, it's called pepene. Pepene verde or pepene galben. The pepene verde, the green pepene, the green watermelon is big, it's huge, it's green on the outside and red on the inside. And the yellow melon, it's yellow all the way through. Well, actually, on the outside is yellow and inside it's uh, a little greenish, but it's very, very sweet. And the uh, green uh, watermelon as well is very sweet. If they are good. Vara uh, oamenii mănâncă pepene verde. In summer, people eat green watermelon. I, I'm, I'm sure that as well in uh, Russia, uh, people are eating uh, green this green watermelon. Um, so also in Romania. Oh, just thinking about it, it makes me want to eat, buy one. Um, next, it's portocală. Portocală. So portocala. Depends on the, the place in the word, uh, phrase. It's orange, as in not the color, but the fruit, orange. And uh, near the um, portocal, it's also mandarina. It's, it's like an orange, but it's a little sour. Yasha um, umplut paharul cu suc de portocale. She filled the glass with orange juice. Yasha umplut paharul cu suc de portocale. Paharul is the, the glass with a suc, with orange uh, juice. Next is ananas. A pineapple. 
pineapple, pineapple, ananas. Ananasul nu, nu se pune pe pizza. Sau nu, opa, <laughs> nu, da, nu poți să pui ananas pe pizza. Ah, pineapple doesn't belong on pizza. Well, this is, you know, a long debate and Italians will, of course, uh, protest and, <laughs> but, um, Some other countries in the world, they don't care. They just put whatever they want on pizza. They put pizza on pizza or burgers on pizza just to make it uh, more flavor. <laughs> so, uh, ananasul nu se pune pe pizza. This is um, an example of phrase. Let's go to page two. Zmeura. These are uh, forest fruits. Um, it means raspberry. Raspberry. Și a făcut un sandwich cu gem de zmeura. She made a sandwich with raspberry jam. Uf, sounds great. Zmeura. And the next one, căpșună. Căpșună. Ah, God, I made a mistake. This is how you write it. Căpșună. I, I, I made a typo here, but this is the, the correct word. Căpșună. Fata are alergie la căpșună. The girl has allergy to strawberries. To strawberry. Strawberries. Depends. Um... Dude. This this is not dude. <laughs> It's dude. The accent is on e. Dude. 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 Uh, mulberries. Când eram mic, mâncam dude din copac. Când eram mic, when I was small, mâncam dude din copac. Um, I was eating uh, dude, mulberries, from the tree. When I was small, I was eating mulberries from the tree. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It didn't matter. Even if they weren't on the tree, they were on the floor. I was still eating them. They were so tasty. Lemuie, lemon. And is uh, lemon and uh, lime. Lime is the smaller, greener um, um, thing. Uh, <laughs> lemon. It's a type of lemon, but it's just even more sour and it's, uh, it's for drinks. It's stuff like that, um, cocktails. So it's called um, lămâie, this is the big one, and the small one is lămâie verde, just for your information. But lămâie is the, the word lemon, suc de lămâie. Suc de lămâie cu miere este bun. Sucul de lămâie cu miere este bun. The lemon uh, with honey juice is good. So you can just mix lemon juice with honey and you just mix it and put some mineral water and you're good to go. Um, castravete, cucumber. I know that a lot of people say that cucumber is a vegetable, but actually it's a, it's a fruit. Castravetele este un fruct. Cucumber is a fruit. It's good to know. And the last page, nuca de cocos. And by the way, uh, I could make like 10 pages, I think, because um, there are so many fruits, but I just don't want to uh, speak about mango for something because they These words are still the same. Uh, avocado, mango, they're really the same words in I think majority of languages. So it didn't make sense to, to bring them up. Just these ones which are different. Nuca de cocos. Coconut. Nuca de cocos. Nut of cocos. Coconut. Pe plaja căzuse o nuca de cocos. On the beach fell a coconut from the coconut tree. Next is mure. Blackberry. Again, mure, nu mur, mure. Murele sunt uh, fructe de pădure. Again, typo, fructe, nu fructi. Fruct e. Sorry, I was, I was in a hurry to make it. I'm sorry. Blackberries are forest fruits. Yeah, so I, I really like forest fruits because they're very, very tasty. And um, mure, uh, blackberries are one of them. Uh, I can make so many things from it. Jams and they're delicious. Murele sunt fructe de pădure. Piersica, peach. Piersica este coaptă. The peach is, was ripe. Era. This is era. Uh, it's a past tense. Piersica este coaptă. The peach was ripe. Pară. Pear. Mere și pere. Apples and pears. Different things. So you can say, for example, that um, apples and pears. Um, they are like things are like apples and pears. They are basically different. So you have to like specifically mention that uh, uh, you know um, these are like different things. So don't don't mix them up. 
this is kind of the expression. So it's not really speaking about apples and pears, but just about different things. Or you can in English, it's for example, apples and oranges. It's something like that. Uh, and the last uh, fruit which I want to mention is cherries. Um, cireasha, cireșe. Cireșe le astea nu au vieri. These cherries don't have worms. You know that in summer you just get cherries and you start opening them and some of them they're unlucky and they have uh, worms inside. So you just, I don't know, sometimes you just throw the worm and eat it. Sometimes you just eat it without even think, looking for the worm. Uh, it's like Russian roulette, and um, <laughs> and sometimes you just uh, you're grossed up and you just throw the whole batch, even though just one of them has worm. But it's good to 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 check, by the way. But the, make make an exception of all this worm thing. Um, the cherries are delicious. So um, I th- if you never tried, uh, you know, buy a few and uh, and try them. You may you may be surprised. So, guys, uh, this was uh, lesson number 12 about fruits, and um, I'm um, thinking to make another one about vegetables because I think it's very, very useful if uh, you travel to Romania and you want to, you know, eat something. <laughs> it's good to, to know the names of the fruits and the vegetables. So, I hope you enjoyed it, and uh, I wish you a beautiful day, summer. Bye bye. Good evening. This is lesson number 13 from Romanian Phrases. Learn Romanian with Vlad. So let's get started. Okay, today's lesson is about uh, vegetables. Uh, we did last time fruit, so now it's time for the vegetables. So let's get to the first one in the list, which is fasole. Fasole means beans. So yeah, fasole means beans. Um, and, and that means that all types of fasole, you can put, for example, fasole verde, uh, and you can say, uh, green beans, um, like this type of, of, of fasole, let's say it like that. Then, uh, varză, this, you read it varză and means cabbage, conopida, cauliflower, cauliflower, yeah, conopida, salata verde. Lettuce. Um, okay, so first of all, salata means salad, uh, and is like let's say the the, um, um, the general uh, definition. And then you have the salata verde, salata uh, creatze and curly, and uh, all types of of salad. Uh, and one type of that is salata verde, which is lettuce in uh, English. Chapo, onion. Uh, chapo is very used and uh, in in uh, you know in soups and so on. So uh, it's very important to know it's chapo, and it's the one which uh, you know doesn't smell nice, <laughs> but uh, it tastes very good in some um, combinations with other uh, things. Chuperch, I like very 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 much mushrooms. Chuperch, um, and also uh, mushroom soup and so on. So uh, chuperch, chuperka is one and uh, like plural uh, is chuperci, mushrooms. Porumb dulce, sweet corn. Porumb means corn, um, and dulce is, means sweet. So porumb dulce, sweet corn. Um, ridiche, radish. Radish is ridiche. I like those uh, radishes. Kartof, potato. Kartofi, potatoes, plural. So kartof, kartof prajit. Um, so it's fried uh, potatoes. Prajit, kartof prajit. Uh, usturoy, garlic. Usturoy, garlic. Roșie, tomato. Roșie, roșie uh, is the, the tomato itself and the color roșu, roșie. Next page. Uh, some phrases now. Uh, the Halloween mancam bostan. On Halloween, we eat pumpkin and sweets. Și dulciuri, of course. Spanacul îți dă mușchi. The spinach gives you muscles. Like the Popeye, the, the sailor man. This is just more or less like a joke. So it doesn't really give you muscles, but it, it gives you some energy. It has some uh, vitamins. So it's really good for you. Uh, pe pizza se pun mirodeni. On pizza, you put 
spices like oregano and some other things. Miroteni means spices, like in general. Celina, celery. Zarzavat, vegetables. Is usually when you say um, I'm going to the market to buy uh, vegetables. If you say modula piazza sa kumpar zarzavat. Uh, means that you're literally going to buy the green, uh, like leaves and all, all kinds of things. But usually they're green. You don't you don't um, uh, buy potatoes, for example. So it's a type of vegetable. It's zarzava. It's a, it's a it's a class of them. Uh, it's referring usually to the green stuff. O dieta sanatoasa contiene legume. So. Uh, a healthy diet contains vegetables, so it's, it's, it's incorporated in a healthy diet. You should um, incorporate a lot of vegetables, legume, forte multa legume, because they are sanatoase, because they are healthy. Dacă ești vegetarian, mănânci salată. If you are vegetarian, you eat salad. Um, so, yeah, if you're vegetarian, you're quite, uh, let's say, limited. But uh, you have a lot of things to eat, so it's not, it's not really a problem. But uh, usually you're eating salad or nuts. Um, are they, and now some, some more examples of uh, vegetables here. Uh, are they is pepper um, and is referring to all types of pepper. Are they grass? Is, is, for example, it's called uh, a type of food, are they grass? Uh, so is there like the peppers which are filled with meat and in the oven is really tasty. Uh, Vunata. Eggplant. Vuneta is the color, is like uh, purplish, and um, is also the, the, the eggplant, is the vegetable itself. Salata de vinete is a good Romanian uh, salad, and is like a, like a spread on, on bread. Um, so you take this eggplant and you, uh, you know, uh, make them pieces and so on, and you mix them, and you get that. Morkov, carrot. Morkov, carrots. So the, the rabbit ate uh, carrots. Patrunjel, parsley, patrunjel, parsley. And the last page, marar, dill. So is, is this expression marar și patrunjel um, is the, the, um, the parsley and the dill. Is, you can use like an expression, marar și patrunjel. Gimbir is ginger. Ginger beer, for example. Hai să bem o bere cu gimbir. Let's drink a ginger beer. A beer with a ginger flavor, ginger taste. Um, I'm not so crazy about them, but, you know, sometimes I can I can try one. În copilerie nu mâncam zarzavaturile. In childhood, I didn't eat vegetables. I think, uh, you know, it's, it's a saying that kids really don't like vegetables and it's it's a universal truth. Mă duc până la piață să cumpăr legume. I'm going to the market, it's like the farmer's market, to buy veggies, to buy vegetables. Um, yeah, mă duc, I'm going to, până la, until, market, piață, să cumpăr legume, to buy vegetables, veg- veggies. O să fac un smoothie din legume. I'm going to make a veggie smoothie. I'm not so crazy about that, but um, yeah, I think it's very, very healthy and refreshing. Uh, the rabbit eats carrots. Yep, that's about it. Am plantat în grădină niște roșii. I planted in the garden some tomatoes. Um, so if you have a garden, it's good to plant some vegetables to have. So you don't really depend on, on the market. So uh, if in the middle of the night you want some fresh tomatoes, you just go into your garden, you pick them up and you make a salad from it. Um, supa mea favorită este cea de linte. My favorite soup is lentil soup. Yeah, it's a lentil one. I like it. And I like also mazare. I didn't write it here, but uh, it's also um, very good. Vara facem porumb fiert. In summer, we're making boiled corn, usually with salt. So how is it? You take this corn, uh, you boil it for, I don't know, maybe three hours or four hours, depends. And then you are taking it off, obviously, um, removing the water, and you are putting salt on it. And then you're just eating it. It's absolutely delicious. So um, I think, I, in fact, I think I'm going to buy some corn today, and I'm going to make that. Uh, it's a very summary, um, summary, uh, 
lunch. Well, not really lunch, but a part of lunch. So guys, uh, thank you for watching. Uh, today we spoke about vegetables, veggies, and um, I think I went through all majority of most important types. Um, and uh, if you think I missed something which is important, please let me know. Okay, have a nice day. Bye-bye. Hello everyone, this is lesson number 14 from Learn Romanian Vlad, Romanian Phrases. And today we're going to speak about animals. So let's get started. Uh, first, let's make a distinction between um, domestic and wild animals. Animale domestice sau animale sălbatice. Uh, we are um, differentiating like that because uh, the domestic animals, we are more... Um, you know, close with because they are in our company and wild animals we see more on the, you know, documentaries or some or zoo or if we're going on a safari or an expedition. So um, let's start with the uh, uh, home animals or farm animals. Uh, animale de companie uh, is basically, uh, they're basically pets, you know, things that we raise since they're small. Um, you can, for example, raise a chicken. You can call it a pet as well, but it's not so common. It's, they're more uh, ready to, to, the, to the farm and food uh, industry. So I think the first, um, first two um, home animals are câine, uh, dog, câine, and cat, pisica. Câinele și pisica, the dog and the cat. They are always animals, but they're sorry, they're always uh, enemies. But um, yeah, sometimes they learn how to, to live with each other. Uh, then we have cal, uh, which is a horse. Um, calul e pe câmp, uh, the horse is on the field, for example. Uh, iepure, rabbit. Iepure, the rabbit, the Easter bunny. Um, iepurele de Paște. Soare, uh, șoarece is a rat. It's the, the small, small uh, rat, which, which eats, you know, uh, seeds and so on. It's, it's also their slippers, I think. Then, uh, if all these animals are sick for any reason or just for control, you call a veterinary, um, Dr. Veterinar. It's really like in English, so it's not really so so different. Uh, then you have uh, pork, uh, pig, pork. De Crăciun am mâncat un porc. On Christmas we ate a pig. This, this is like, let's say, in Europe, uh, very useful, very, very uh, common. In some countries, um, the pork is not um, for eating. Basically, it's considered... Um, um, dirty so people don't eat it uh, but in europe and us i think if, kind of majority of people are eating uh, pork if they're not vegetarians or vegans that is uh, then uh, gaina is the chicken supa de gaina or chorba de gaina a chicken soup and vaca is cow vaca um, well this vaca um, in India, for example, it's um, it's considered saint, so it's a it's a like a precious animal, so you don't uh, eat you don't eat it um, in India. So it's, it's very specific uh, to India. Otherwise, in other countries, uh, there is no no such a you know mandatory uh, denial of of of, uh, of this animal. Um, I'm not really sure if, for example. Um, you can drink milk uh, from uh, from cow because you know you don't want to exploit it. Uh, the animal in India, I'm talking about, but I, I need to read more about it anyway. Page two. La ferma animalelor aveau găini. At the animal farm, they had chicken. Well, they had chicken. They had sheep, oi, oițe, mielușei, the the small uh, sheep. Taur is the bull. It's from Red Bull, for example. Uh, the big animal, the big, uh, the the husband of uh, of the cow, leu. Leu is a lion, and just a small um, um, thing or some piece of information here about leu. Uh, Romanian money are called lei, the lions. It's uh, <laughs> very interesting. Actually, I need to to read why why they call it leu. 
why they call it lion when it's not like we have lions in Romania but uh, this is just interesting maybe it's coming from ruble uh, from the Russian money lay lay ruble I don't know I would have to check about it now the next animal is capriwara the deer capriwara it's in the forest it's in grass it's very it's uh, uh, herbivore uh, animal it's uh, uh, very peaceful sharpe snake sharpe tigru now we are already going to um like wild animals and uh, more exotic animals uh, sharpe is snake of course in, in the jungle the tiger tigru is, is very very common tigru tiger monkey maimuza maimuza maimuzika the small monkey maimuzika elephant elephant is absolutely the same uh, la gradina zoologică sunt multe animale exotice. At the zoo, there are a lot of exotic animals. At the zoo, there are a lot of exotic animals. Câinele era de rasă. The dog had a good pedigree. Had what a good, uh, I don't know how to call it, like a race or brand or type of uh, animal. So rasă is, is race, basically, but is it, you know, the what, what the parents were, if they were champions or not, and so on. And the page number three, braconieri vânează rinoceri. The hunter, the traffickers, hunter, a rhino, uh, or rhinos. Um, so this is actually a problem that this uh, animal uh, skin traffickers and, and uh, you know, uh, th- uh, animal, um, for example, uh, elephants, teeth, um, they are, uh, basically, animals are killed and they, they steal the, the the animal and they start selling basically my pieces or, or skin or stuff like that um so that's a big problem uh because these animals they will eventually disappear if you just uh kill them without discrimination so um yeah this is a not very pleasant word but braconieri they're the thieves of animals the hunters also um at the post pentru animale this is animal shelter so you if you find a dog on the street and you don't want to keep it you can just go to this shelter and they take care of it so go to other post pentru animale pantera se ascunde în tufiș Pan- the panther is hiding in the bush pantera se ascunde în tufiș turmele de gazele beau apă de râu the gazelle herds drink river water which is very uh, good to know where the gazelles are. You just follow the river and you will uh, find them eventually. And also the the predators as well. They know this fact and they hunt them close to the river, especially the crocodiles. Femeia are gianta de crocodile. The woman has crocodile bag. Well, yeah, it's... uh, Yeah, yeah, if you you like animals and you you really don't want to have like a bag made of, of... of an animal you know so of a crocodile you, there are some fake uh, leathers you can use and it looks literally the same and so you don't need to kill an animal to get your bag so yeah anyway it's just an example of um a phrase with a crocodile șopârele au sânge rece șopârele au sânge rece the lizards have cold blood so they are you know they don't have <laughs> they don't look like they have feelings so they look straight to you and they they kill without remorse so yeah it's known that sh- lizards are uh, ruthless lanzul trophic this is an expression uh, regarding food chain so you know the the let's say the animal uh, the top predator is in, in uh, top obviously and then you know what what he's eating the, the next and the next and the next until the, you reach the plants Leul este, uh, leul este regele animalelor. The lion is king of the animals. Leul este regele animalelor. The lion is king of the animals. Puiul de girafă este îngrijit de mama lui. The giraffe baby is taken care of by his mother. So you will see in zoos, for example, uh, they have this, um, you know, birth. Uh, like exposition or something and when when an animal is um, giving birth then everybody's invited to, to see the baby after some time so um, you know it's not very common when animals in zoo in captivity they are giving birth so it's it's uh, it's uh, like a celebration all across the zoo 
and everybody likes to see the new newborn uh, you know giraffe or monkey or gorilla or whatever so yeah and uh, with this uh, we end this uh, lesson number 14 uh, it's about animals and i really hope to that you liked it and it was useful for you so thank you very much for watching and goodbye bye bye it's lesson number uh, 15 from learn romanian with vlad um, today's lesson it's about body body um, and uh, the parts i think it's interesting if you for especially if you're um, you know going to the doctors and you need to um, you know say what your where is the pain uh, is good to point to the right um, place so let's get started first and foremost is brats uh, brats is arm in english and romanian is brats brace uh, both you know arms shastrans copy in brace um he hugged his kids in obviously in arms he hugged them with the arms um so brats brace um glezna is uh, ankle is on the on the foot For, and there is this expression uh, joc de glezne is like um, when you're uh, for example playing football and your coach is telling you hey joc de glezne hi joc de glezne um, so it's like football saying uh, basically to basically kind of move move around don't don't stay joc de glezne is like move your um, ankles um, i think Another important part of the body is the blood itself, uh, sunge, is, um, you know, uh, all parts from, from head to toe. Um, it's filling your body and is very, very important. Um, without it, you will die instantly. So, sunge. Um, example of a phrase with this would be, um, pe camas are putin o pata de sunge, on the shirt. He or she has a um, blood drop stain. Bone, os, os oase. Um, skeletul are multe oase. The skeleton has a lot of bones. Creier, brain. Spui lucruri fără creier. You're saying things without a brain, without thinking, without, um, you know, head. Stupid things, basically. Cray, uh, um, you know, without the brain, you will no, cannot think and you will die. Um, for a creer, mori, um, posa gandeshti, mori. Cup, head, inside of the head, there is a brain. And cup, yes, the creer, cup. Um, sun is a breast, and on the chest. Piept, piept, chest, yeah. Now, a barbie. This is not Barbie, but it's barbie. This is the accent. Barbie is the chin. I wrote barbie from Wasa. He or she has a beautiful chin. Ureke, a year. Uh, okay, here you, you notice that I just put words because um, I think the... the um, the phrases is not it's not really hard to imagine the phrases in some context so it's not i'm trying to put the phrases just in case um it's not clear in what circumstance you can use that word but for example ear yeah he has long ears um lung or gura gura mouth gura gura larga um has um you know large mouth when he's smiling are o gură mare, largă, când zâmbește. Nas, nose. Nas, nose. Ochi, eyes. Un ochi, doi ochi. Uh, one eye, two eyes. Păr, păr, hair. Um, are părul lung. Uh, she has long hair. Păr, ochi, păr. Unghi, unghie. Nails, nail salon, salon de unghi, de manicure, unghi, uh, digit, finger, finger, zece digit la mână, I have ten fingers on hands, heart, inima, mă doare inima când aud vești proaste, my heart is 
um, hurting. My heart is hurt. My heart is hurting when uh, I hear bad news. Inimo, you broke my heart. May rupt inimo. May farumate inimo. This is not mate. Is uh, matze. This is tse. matze. Intestines. Intestines. So it's like the guts, basically. Uh, riniki. Riniki. Kidney. Kidney stones. Pietrucella uh, riniki. So you must drink water. Um, on the face now. Uh, buza is the lip. Buze. Are buze uh, sensuale. She has uh, sensual lips. Buza. Buze. Tooth. Dinte. Teeth. Uh, dinti. Dinte. Are dinti albi. He has white teeth. Dinte. Dinti. Quaste. Ribs. Um, oh, phrase with uh, ribs. Um, okay. La restaurant. Am, or, am comandat coaste uh, dulci. Uh, in the restaurant, I ordered uh, sweet ribs. Limba. Tongue. So it's like mother tongue. Um, limba materna. Or, of course, the, the organ. The tongue. Mijloc is waste. Is Mijloc is also uh, the middle. Mijloc uh, strezi in the middle of the road. But it's also the waste. Mijloc. Madore Mijloc is hurting my waist. Coloana vertebrală. Um, this is basically the spine. Um, yeah, so it's, it's the backbone, the spine. Madoare, it's good to go, when you go to the doctors, you can say Madoare ceva in. It is hurting in or on, or it really depends. But you can say, for example, Madoare aici is hurting here. Madoare is like it's hurting. And then you say, you know, where? Uh, or just put, if you don't know how it's called, um, you just, uh, you know, touch the place and <laughs> they know. Uh, organe is organs. Um, so yeah, it is really the same word. Now um, it's not get, is good, good, neck. Um, fata are un gât, uh, lung. The girl has a long neck. Good. It's a neck. Um, plămâni is l- their lungs. Um, un plămân, doi plămâni. Uh, one lung, two lungs. Plămâni. And last but not least is picioare, feet. O dor picioare de după atât a mers. They are hurting my feet after so much walking on the street. So, okay, so this is the lesson number 15 uh, related to body parts. And I actually intentionally left some words out because... Um, yeah, I, I think you kind of got the, the idea. I think the, the main parts of the body, I think they are um, in, in this video. So if you go through it a couple of times, you will kind of um, understand how um, how to, to call different body parts and how they sound, actually. So um, I hope you enjoyed this video um, as well. And uh, please uh, leave a comment if you think I missed something. <laughs> okay, so enjoy, guys. See you. Bye-bye. Hi guys, how are you? Uh, today we have lesson number 16 from Romanian phrases from um, Learn Romanian with Vlad. So today's lesson, today's topic is birds. So let's get started, like always. Okay, so first of all, uh, in Romanian, pasare is bird. The word bird is pasare. Pasare de prado, for example, uh, bird of prey. Um, you know, it, it's it's um, some some birds that are not of prey, obviously. So um, it's good to mention. Um, so uh, you know what is a bird cage? Yes, you probably know. Uh, if you have ever had a parrot, for example, home, uh, you probably uh, kept him into a bird cage, um, and that in Romanian is called colivie, colivie, golden uh, bird cage. Um, Colivia de Aur, Aurita, 
So it's, it's this metal thing uh, in which uh, you know birds uh, live. But it's not when I when I honestly when I see them, I don't feel really good because I know that the birds are meant to, to fly and to from branch to branch and tree to tree. And when you see them in that small cage, is ah, I, I really don't enjoy seeing them. But yeah, what can can you do? I mean, you can buy them and set them free. But you know, anyway. Um, next in line is chuara. It means crow. Is this black um, bird? In when I was to, in Japan, uh, I saw these enormous uh, crows. Niște chori uriașe. I didn't even believe that they, they are real. They are so so big. Um, and there was also a, a movie called The Crow. Um, so yeah. Uh, next is cook, the cuckoo, the cuckoo is this bird which uh, leaves their eggs into other uh, nests, um, <laughs> you know, other birds' nests, and they take care of them. It's it's a little yeah. It's, this is very interesting word, um, and it says cuckoo, cuckoo. You can hear it, so you know how it sounds. Um, the next, I think, the most um, I don't know frequent bird you can see in, in cities, especially in Romania, is um, the dove, is the porumbel, porumbelul păci, a venit. The peace dove came. Um, is this bird which, I when I was small, I was feeding them, so um, I have good memories with them. And of course, all these birds, what is, like, what they have in common is that, obviously, they, they fly and they have all wings and uh, feathers. So, um, pana is the feather, and uh, the wing is um, aripa. Aripa. I forgot actually to put it here. Unbelievable. Such an important thing. So, pana, feather. Paunul are pene frumoase. The peacock has beautiful feathers, very colorful and long. Vultur. Uh, this is like bird of prey. Uh, vultur, eagle. Are ochi de shoim. He has falcon eyes, very sharp. The falcons see perfectly, like five kilometers. Uh, shoim is the falcon. So you have vulture, eagle, then you have shoim, the falcon. Then you have these birds uh, near uh, the port, near the boats. They are called uh, pescarush, the gulls, seagulls, you know. Uh, they are um, hunting fish usually. Next is the our favorite goose is guska, is the bird from the you know from the farm. You can have goose, geese. Sorry. Uh, all these birds, uh, when they are migrating, for example, uh, they are flying into something called stall. And stall is like a flock. It's like a grouping of birds. So. Um, Păsările au plecat în stol în țările, către țările calde. The birds left in a flock towards warm countries, like for winter. It's known that because in Romania is like temperate climate and in winter is very, very cold. Um, and the birds, which are normally uh, in summer, cannot survive the winter. They need some you know, warmer temperature. So they uh, in autumn, they start disappearing and they fly to, to south, somewhere in south, um, in warmer countries, I don't know, in Africa or wherever. And uh, they stay the winter and then they return in spring. So the, they fly into this flock. So they, they are like a group, a mass of birds. They all fly together so they do not get lost. Next is Gaina, hen. It's a chicken coop. Gaina, the hen. Then you have mierloi, mockingbird. Is this um, bird which you make some sound, for example, in the forest, and she will <laughs> kind of uh, repeat back to you what um, what uh, you said. So it's like like an echo. It's called mier mierlo, mierloi. Pasarile migraza. Like I said before, uh, birds migrate, so they they fly away, they move, and they come back. Uh, their house, the, the bird's house, is called quib. Its nest is made by the birds themselves 
um, for the for the eggs. So before you have eggs, they make the nest, so they prepare the house, let's say, and then then uh, they make the eggs, uh, and they are all stored in the quib in the nest. Aukazut, um, we showed it in quib. Ah, this is an unhappy event. The chicks fell from the nest. The wind blew, the tree moved, and the chicks fell from the nest. Vântul a bătut vântul, copac cu s-a mișcat și puișori au căzut din cuib. Privighetoare. This is Nightingale. She is singing very, very beautiful. Struts. Ostrich. You know, it's this expression that don't don't uh, act like an ostrich. Don't put your head in the in the under the sand like an ostrich. So basically, the expression is to um, don't um, you know pretend that things don't exist around you. So be aware and uh, you know deal with them. Um, and also, I'm văzut că oile de struț sunt foarte mari. I heard ostrich eggs are very big. Yes, it's true. They're pretty big. Um, I never ate one. I'm not even sure if you can eat one, um, but uh, yeah, they're they're very big. Now, uh, night bird bufnica, bufnica is the owl. Bufnica is considered an um, wiseness. Uh, is is like a symbol of wiseness um, or and knowledge. Papagal is the parrot. Some parrots are you can teach them actually how to uh, speak. And also the crows, you can teach her how to speak. They're so sp- that smart. So papagal, papagal, parrot, raven, korb. Ah, I miss them. In Romanian, should be on the left side. Uh, so korb is in Romanian. Uh, korb is the, the raven, is the blackbird. Uh, prihor is robin, another kind of small bird. Graur, starling. Lebedem, the swan, you know, the swan lake, the black swan. Uh, Lebeda Negra um, is the, there are these beautiful birds, uh, white birds usually. And um, you can actually see them on, on uh, in some lakes. Quada, the tail, all these birds have a tail um, and that is called quada. It's not just for birds, of course, the quad is a tail, you know, a lot of animals have tail, but usually it's a quad. Pitulice, wren. Then you have uh, Ciocanitoare, the woodpecker, the famous woody woodpecker. Uh, is this bird which uh, makes, <laughs> it smacks the, the, the beak into the tree. By the way, beak in Romanian is called uh, choc. Is hitting the, the beak on the tree and is taking worms from inside so to, to eat. So it's chocanitoare. Chocanitoare. It's making this too, like in wood. And vrabie, vrabiuza, is a sparrow, like Captain Sparrow from Pirates of the Caribbean. Uh, vrabie. Yes, and this is lesson number 16 about birds. Uh, guys, this, this one is a little shorter because honestly, I don't know a lot about birds. Um, so I don't want to, you know, speak about toucans and, and stuff because they are really kind of different, different. And I don't have a lot of experience with them. Uh, and I honestly don't, some of them, I don't even know how they look like. Uh, but um, yeah, I, I think this, I just covered the majority of birds, um, which, you know, you can find if you go into a forest in Romania. So uh, I hope you enjoyed this uh, relatively short video. And um, yeah, tell me if you like birds in general. <laughs> And only if you had one uh, home growing up. Okay, guys, so see you and speak to you later. Bye-bye. Hello, everybody. Today is lesson number 17 from Romanian Phrases with Learn Romanian with Vlad. So let's get started. Uh, today's lesson is about fish. Um, I'm not sure if you like so much the lesson about uh, birds, but um, this one, yeah, let's see. Let's see, maybe it's better. <laughs> so... Uh, let's get started. Pește de apă dulce sau sărată. Well, fish is generally they categorize into um, types sweet and salty water. Uh, so like sea fish, salty, and uh, river, um, like sweet uh, water, like normal water, the drinkable water. And salty, you know, the, you cannot drink the water from the sea. So, But the fishes don't matter, don't care. Um, and one example of that um, is somn. It's called somn. 
it's called catfish in English. Uh, son uh, is this fish with um, with a, like mustache, <laughs> mustaches, and uh, it's very tasty. Um, the som is also the, the word som. If you don't think about fish, it's also um, sleep means sleep in Romanian. Am prins un som de 30 de kilograme. I caught a 30 kilos fish, catfish, 30 kilograms. In Romania, we, we weight things in kilograms, so, and distances in kilometers. Just small FYI. Um, tipar. This is not typer, tipar. It's tipar. Uh, and it's eel. Uh, electric eel, you know. Um, then we have shark, rekin. Rekin. In um, in Asia, it's very it's like a they make some kind of trafficking with the, the shark fins, the, the tail, the the yeah, it's, it's not good. Um, so rekin is uh, you know this is the out uh, ultimate predator <laughs> in the sea is the shark rekin. When you see his tail, uh, his fin up going swimming towards you, you run, or swim, or whatever. Peștele de aur, uh, goldfish, is the goldfish, which usually it's um, giving you um, some kind of wishes if you catch him, goldfish. Rechinul chocan, um, is the hammerhead shark. It's, it's a little weird how it looks like, but uh, yeah. Uh, Pastrevul de lac, is the lake trout. Pastrov is the trout and the lac is the lake from the lake where you can like fish. Macro is the mackerel. Macro, yeah. Stuka, pike. Okay, so this is this is how you pronounce this. It's a little weird. You pronounce it like this. Stuka, stuka. It's very fast uh, going out of your tongue. There's no stuka. It's stuka, stu. Stuka is the pike. Pește balon is the puffer fish. Is this fish which looks like a? It's very funny. It's like a ball and it's full of pins. It's scary looking fish, uh, or funny depends. Next is uh, in jungle trește peștele piranha. In the jungle there are piranha fish living. There are these piranha fa infamous piranha fish which are you know this. Uh, Nasty looking creatures. Uh, we, if you if you give them some some live animal, they will just uh, kill him instantly. And they're basically eating. normally fishes don't eat um, like live meat. They don't hunt live prey. But these fishes are absolute beasts. So yeah, try to ignore uh, swimming in, in lakes of jungle. Kalkan uh, is ray fish. Kalkan. Salmon is salmon. Is this pink? Pink fish is very, very tasty. Salmon, salmon, salmon. Sturion, sturgeon. Very similar. Also, salmon looks the same. Conserva de sardine, canned sardines. That is, you open it um, and uh, you eat it. Uh, small fishes, you know. Ton, tuna, tuna fish, salata de ton. Uh, tuna salad. The biggest um, whale, eh, the biggest, uh, the biggest whale is the blue whale, balena albastra. Huge, huge animal. Peștele trește în mare. Wow. Uh, the fish lives in the sea. Yeah, this is a little. <laughs> the fish lives in the sea. Yes, he does. Um, la râu nu pot să pescuiesc nimic. At the river, I cannot fish anything. I just everything is just. So fast, I cannot catch anything. Undita. Pescarul are o barca no. The fisherman has a new boat. So it's uh, faster, it can go further. Um, I don't know, it has some all the tools inside. So uh, Pescarul, the fisherman, has a new boat. Camomela a pus un viermisor. Uh, as a trap, he put a... Um, a worm, ah, worm, Jesus Christ, I made a mistake here, sorry, uh, it's worm, W-O-R-M, 
So um, when you are fishing, you obviously have to put some some trap for the. I don't know how it's called honestly. Honestly, I, in English, I don't know how it's called. I think it's called trap. Um, it, it's basically you just uh, put um, the um, the worm on top of the fishing set, and you just put it in the water and hope for the best that the fish will will catch. And the last page about fishes. La polo nord pescuesti la copca. At the North Pole, you fish through this ice hole. So because everything is like frozen, uh, and you have water underneath, you just uh, smack the ice, make a hole, and you fish there because otherwise, you know, you cannot. Um, urshi polar mananka pește view. Polar bears eat live fish. Urshi polar, the polar bears, mananka, they are eating pește view. View means alive. So, you know, they grab it, they eat it instantly. They're so hungry. Um, yeah, you know, I, <laughs> I assume that all the animals which are, you know, catching fish and eating them alive, it's not like they cook them. But, uh, you know, it's, it's this image when, when you see this um, fish uh, in, the, in the paw of the bear, it's ugh, bloody and everything. Facem o supă de pește? Should we make a fish soup? Yes, please. Da, te rog. Icre, roe, caviar. Uh, so the icre, they are these eggs, basically, of, of the fish. Um, and you can make salad, you can make like a spread. On, you can eat them with uh, bread. Peștele mare mănâncă pe cel mic. This is an expression, it's a saying. Uh, so the big fish always is the small. So, you know, like in life, uh, the stronger always be the weak. Souls. These are... A scaly, the the scales on the on the fish, you know, or on the snake. And in fact, they are called souls. Souls de pește, curăț peștele. You clean the fish from souls. Um, aripioare de pește, fish fins. Yeah, he's helping himself with the fins to 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 swim in the water. Aquarium, it's aquarium, aquarium, aquarium. Pește prăjit. I really, really like gr grilled fish. This prăjit is like fried here, but pește la grătar, grilled fish. So guys, this is lesson number 17. This is the end of the lesson. It's about the fishes. Um, yeah, like with the birds, <laughs> I don't have a lot of experience with them, uh, even though I I grew up on, on the Danube, on the river, and everybody was fishing there. So, um, but still, I don't know. But I really enjoy fishes, all types of fishes. So, um, if you like fish, leave a comment. And uh, if you don't, leave as well. So, thank you very much for watching and listening, and uh, I wish you a pleasant day ahead. Bye bye. Hello guys, this uh, lesson is about uh, geography and this is lesson number 18 from uh, Romanian Phrases, Learn Romanian with Vlad. So let's get started. Okay, so first question. Ce notă ai luat la geografie? What mark have you got at the geography in school? Um, I uh, liked as well uh, history, so for me I had always kind of better um, marks at the history than geography, but you know. Everybody with what they like. Câte continente există? How many continents do they exist? How many continents exist? Are there? Is another uh, question. Um, America este formată din state. America uh, is made out of states. You know, United States of America. Yeah? So, um, America este formată din state. State este uh, o zonă. Yeah? La oraș, at the city, la țară, at the country side. So, uh, we are asked usually uh, in Romania if ești de la oraș sau ești de la țară. Basically, it means if you are born in the city or at the village. Uh, or um, la țară, țară means country, but in this context, la țară means village uh, or uh, not city, basically. Um, provincie. It's a zone, state, or municipality. So, provincia uh, is provincial. Uh, you are basically not from the capital. Uh, you are from any other city except the capital. And that's provincia. It's a zone. It's a it's a um, state. Like it's like a state. You know. Atlas scolar. 
um, School Geography Atlas. So it's this book which usually they give you every year to, to learn geography. Um, and it's called Atlas Scholar. Capitala este București. The capital city is Bucharest and not Budapest. Um, so the capital is, um, you know, in the case of Romania is Bucharest. In case of France is Paris. This is just an example. Now the coordinates, yeah? Uh, so we have like this, Est, West, Nord, Sud. So it means East, West, North and South. Um, la West, la Est, la Nord și la Sud. Uh, in Sudul țării, in the South of the country. Globul pământesc is the globe. Is the, um, you know, is the, it's like a plastic toy, let's say, uh, with a, with a old map. Uh, drawn on it and you can just spin it and you put the finger and you go there travel there so that's the global pomentesk hemisphere is the hemisphere you know the world the, the earth has uh, two hemispheres now the next page insula paradisului the paradise island the insula is it's a type of it's like part of geography you know you learn about islands um insula it's called in romanian um, and what you imagine is, you know, coconuts, uh, this, uh, beautiful sand, um, palm trees, and uh, just heaven on earth. And, and obviously surrounded by water. That's the, the whole deal with the island. Distanza se măsoară în kilometri. Ah, I made a mistake here. Uh, the distance is measured in kilometers. So in um, Europe, uh, we measure distance in kilometers, yeah? And weight in uh, kilograms. Uh, harta is the map. Harta. arată pe harta unde este orașul Brașov. Please show me on the map where is the city called Brașov. Yeah? Munte is the mountain. La munte sau la mare. Uh, the mountain or the seaside. Munte. Oceanul Pacific, the Pacific Ocean. This is, you know, there are more oceans, but this is just an, an example. Oceanul Pacific. Tropice, the tropics. Now the countries, uh, the tropical countries. Yeah? Uh, desert, desert. Yeah? So this is not desert, it's desert. desert. In desert, sunt dune de nisip. In the desert, there are sand dunes. Mergem în excursie cu vaporul pe mare. We're going on a cruise ship on the sea. So you can go on the sea with a ship, with a cruise ship. Vale is valley. Vale. La vale. At the, on, you know, on the valley. Um, Busola is the compass. So if you're lost somewhere and you have a compass in hand, you can find the right direction, uh, but by following the compass and a map. So in Romanian would be dacă te-ai pierdut undeva, folosești busola și harta să-ți găsești drumul înapoi. And the last page. De pe deal se vedea orașul mai bine. From the hill, you could see better the city. So, you know, you can go on the hill to see the city lights at night. Um, să te urci pe un deal să vezi uh, luminile orașului mai bine. <coughs> um, vulcanul din Islanda. Icelandic volcano. You know, if you, if you <laughs> watched uh, the, um, the serial on Netflix uh, called Katla, It's about that. Uh, it's about the volcano um, and capital of uh, um, Iceland is Reykjavik. Pe vârful muntelui era zăpadă. On the mountain peak there was snow. Pe vârful muntelui, pe vârful is like the top of the hill or the peak of the mountain, there was snow. Era zăpadă. Uh, jungla amazoniană. The Amazonian jungle. So, oh, sorry, page back. Amazonian jungle. So it's uh, very green. You know, you can see it from the satellite that is green. It's a huge, huge forest. It's a jungle. Fluvio, the river. Example of that, um, Danube, the river. You know, 
it goes through multiple countries it's huge or Vultava in uh, Czech Republic uh, big one it's a big one yeah, yeah, yeah. it's not a small uh, river it's a big one the fluvium Granica Granica um, border so um, why I mentioned here that uh, usually the borders are enforced and they were drawn uh, on the maps based on uh, the environment like the the you know topology of the of the ground so if you had a mountain between two countries two zones you you would cross you know you would say that okay the mountain is split between those countries and it's considered a uh, natural uh, like border uh, so it's called granica yeah granica naturale relief is the topology of the ground how is it for example what kind of ground is there what what form of uh, ground is there so chiffel the zona de relief peștera is the cave peștera yeah and you have here peșteri subacvatice underwater caves peștera peștera de sare uh, is a, you know the salt cave cascada niagara is the niagara falls cascada Cascada is, you know, what fall is, is when um, like a lot of uh, water is falling from a cliff uh, and it's called Cascada. So it's like a drop down, very abrupt and uh, called that Cascada. So this is the lesson number 18. Um, we spoke today about uh, geography, like relief, about um, types of uh, what the world has, contains actually, you know. Uh, mountain sea uh, deserts and dunes and <laughs> and so on and so on so i hope you enjoyed it and you found this uh, video informative and useful and uh, i'm waiting for you uh, tomorrow see you bye bye hi guys good day uh, today's lesson is lesson number 19 and it's about uh, jobs and occupations basically so let's get started i think this one will be very useful for you so let's start with the jobs. Um, of course, I could go on and on and on. There are so many, uh, but I just, uh, on the top of my head, I just put some of you. So we'll start. Merchelar is butcher, is the, the person which, um, you know, <laughs> is basically um, preparing the, the food for um, processing. Um, so it's called Merchelar. You can buy meat from Merchelar. You can buy um, meat from the meat shop. Uh, constructor, constructor, sorry, <laughs> constructor, uh, builder is the guy who is building the house. It's not, it's not really the um, architect. That's architect is the one which is designing the house. But uh, this one is the one which actually does the work, the heavy lifting. Constructor. Taximetrist is the cab driver. So his taxi is like the cab, and taximetrist is the person which drives um, the cab. It takes you to the airport and so on. Majordom. Majordom is English for uh, butter, butler. Sorry, butter. butler. Um, is the person which takes care of, um, you know, your um, accommodation, let's say, to you to, to be uh, taken care of uh, when you're in visit somewhere. Bukatar is cook. Yeah. Bukataria is the place where the cooking takes place and bukatar is the cook is the main cook funcionar is the clerk in the on the uh, okay so i went to the bank and i spoke with a clerk am fost la bancă și am vorbit cu un funcționar nu cu bancher pentru că bancher is something else but uh, funcționar yeah is the the person in the till which is gives you some some money or speaks there if you want to take a loan policist it's a cup. Police is the yeah, police and uh, policie and policist is cup. Also, we used to have in Romania um, milici milician, yeah, la milicie. So it's like more. Um, hmm. We considered uh, that we have milicie before uh, revolution. You know, in communism we had milician, and now we have pol policeman, policist. Next is uh, engineer. Engineer. It sounds very, very similar. Engineer. Yeah. Electrician and so on. 
with electricity, uh, repairing sockets and so on. Mama copilului lucra ca și educatoare. Kid's mother was working as a teacher. Um, educatoare, this word, educatoare, um, is basically referring to a person which is um, teaching small kids. Yeah? We have învățătoare, educatoare. So this is like kind of taking care of the education, not of Mm, it's more like uh, general rules, not uh, an învățătoare is the one which is actually teaching you, you know, geography, uh, history and so on, mathematics. But educatoare is more the person from uh, one to five. You know, it's more like um, hmm, uh, crowd control <laughs> administrator, you know, for, for small kids. You know, it's not focusing so much on, I mean, it teaches you how to read and write, but uh, yeah, anyway. So it's referring to small kids, yeah, this is what you have to remember, educatoare. Uh, nu este greu să-ți găsești de lucru. It's not hard to find a job. Yeah? Nu este greu să-ți găsești de lucru. De lucru means something to do, something to work on. Yeah? Face naveta în fiecare zi. She's commuting to work every day. Uh, I'm not sure if you have to actually mention to work. Because I think commuting, it implies that it's about work. You're moving there to, to work, not traveling for, for fun. Face naveta în fiecare zi. She's commuting every day. Yeah. Uh, Floreasa are o rochie colorată. The florist, the lady in this case, has a colorful dress. Floreasa. This is the type of job, you know, the, the person which is um, uh, preparing, the, arranging the flowers, bouquets and so on. Hunter. Vânător. It's referring to, you know, hunter, hunting deer, uh, deers and uh, wild boar and so on. Bijutier. Bijutier. It comes from bijuterie, jewelry. Yeah? Bijutier is the person which is shaping the, the, the glass. Paysagist is landscaper. The person which is, um, yeah, you know what the landscaper is, yeah. So, paysagist. Salvamar. Okay, this word means lifeguard. Um, salva means to save, and mar is like mare from the sea. So, salvamar, um, lifeguard. If you drown, you you know the lifeguard jumps into water like Baywatch to save your life. Assistant medical. This is nurse. And nurse uh, is uh, referring to a man and a woman. So, assistant or assistant medical if it's a woman, or assistant medical if it's a man. Pilotul de Boeing are mulți bani. The Boeing pilot has a lot, uh, sorry, bot, bot of money, a lot of money, typo. Has a lot of money. The Boeing pilot has a lot of money because he's doing a lot of, um, you know, traveling. So, he does a lot of shifts, so he gets a lot of money. Uh, arbitru, referee. You know, the, the football match was stopped by the referee. Uh, matchul de fotbal a fost oprit de către arbitru. Arbitru is the referee. Cântăreț, singer. Cântăreț, cântat is uh, to sing, and cântăreț is the person which does the singing. So cântăreață, if it's a woman. Cântăreață, cântăreț. Fără studii, nu ai mare șansă. Uh, well, this is, I'm, I'm not sure why I put this one here. It's related to, you know, to finding a job. Without education, you won't have a lot of chance. You won't have a chance. You won't stand a chance. So you need to have some kind of minimum education if you want to get a job. And higher education if you want to have a better job, better paid job. With a lot of, uh, you know, money and um, opportunities later on. Știi ce te poate întreba la interviu? So, you go to the interview and your mom is asking you, you know, știi ce poate, te poate întreba la interviu? Do you know what it can ask you at the interview? What kind of questions, you know, so you can prepare in advance. And uh, some of the examples are as follows. Am X ani de experiență. I have X years of experience. You know, I have 10 years of experience as a builder. Am 10 ani de experiență ca și constructor. Aceasta e... Acesta este CV-ul meu. This is my CV. This is my curriculum vitae. This is my CV. Acesta este CV-ul meu. Yeah? Um, and other types of jobs. Uh, scriitor. You know, self-employed. Uh, writer. Uh, 
Kellner, it's waiter. So Kellneritza is waiter, you know, the lady. Um, eu lucrez la birou. La birou means to the... Yeah, okay, so I'm, it means that I'm working in an office, basically. But eu lucrez la birou. Birou is the table. In Initially, it was called a table where you're actually working. But then they called the actual office, the room, uh, called birou. But the bureau itself is just the table where you're working with a computer on top or you know, on a printer and a phone. This is called bureau, la bureau. But usually when you say uh, lucrez la bureau, people automatically assume that you're working in an office. You know, if, of course you have a table, otherwise, you know, it would be weird. Fata muncește de acasă. The girl is working remotely from home. You know, she can be a writer or whatever. Muncește. She's working. It's like, uh, you know, working. Lucreza is like more... It's, it's their synonym. Lucreza muncește. Tura de noapte. The night shift. I used to work long, long time ago for night shift for like six months and it was so tough from 10 p.m. to 6 a.m. It was absolutely horrible. It was very, very tiring. And I said to myself, I will never work again if I can. If I can. Tura de noapte. So in the night shift. Medic de ambulanță. Ambulance, ER doctor, the guy who is, when you call, is coming to you and saving your life. Medic de ambulanță. Um, pompier, the firefighter, fireman, is the guy which jumps into flames to, to save the cat or people. Pompier. Yeah? Soldat, soldier. Soldat is soldier, yeah? Și armată, soldații lucră, um, sunt în armată. The soldiers are in the army, obviously. So, guys, this is this was uh, lesson number 19 uh, related to jobs and occupations. Uh, as you noticed, because I have to fit everything in three slides, um, I had to really cherry pick them. Uh, I could make 10 more slides with what I know. But um, if you want more jobs, uh, more uh, specific, um, I can make another uh, video for that. So until then, you know, I hope you enjoyed this one. And uh, yeah, sharing is caring. Bye-bye. Hello, everyone. Today's lesson is lesson number 20 uh, from Learn Romanian with Vlad. And the lesson title is Alphabet. So we're going to learn the alphabet uh, of uh, in, in Romania. So let's get started. Okay, so uh, <laughs> don't get uh, don't get uh, nervous when I, when I look at all these words. Uh, is, this uh, lesson is not about uh, understanding every word. Uh, it's just about listening to my voice uh, how I pronounce them. So let's start with the first letter, which is A. A. And the ex some examples for with uh, words which start with letter A. Uh, as I say, I don't say A like in English. I say A. Uh. Um, some words are as follows. Animale, acasă, audio, Alina. Alina means it's, it's a name of a girl. Alina, ananas, albine. Then we have something like an A with some uh, hat. Um, and this you uh, pronounce a. Uh. So no, a, uh, a, uh, a. Uh. It's like a more serious A. So a, uh. a uh, yeah, a uh, asta, a, uh, ăștia, a uh, yeah, those there. Uh, there are not a lot of words which start with a. Uh, uh. It's, it's called ă, uh, yeah? Then ă uh din a, this is pronounced ă. Uh. So it's, it's another a with a hat, ă. Uh. So a, ă, ă. And uh, unfortunately, there are no um, words we start with this, this letter, ă. Uh. Yeah, so you will find it, but you will find it inside words. Um, oops, sorry. Then we'll have uh, udin e. 
Yeah, and then we'll give you some examples. Now, B, B, or B. Yeah, this is how you pronounce. I'm, I'm just gonna say it uh, in Romanian directly, so you'll listen, um, not be confused. So this is B, B, Bebeluș, Barca, Bostan, Bibelo, Berbec, Bora Bora. Yeah, so this is B. Imagine that you you have a b, a b and a u b. This is how you uh, read it. Now c, c, k. Yeah, this this is how we pronounce uh, this c. K, carte, cântecele, cravată, cozonac, cafe. Yeah, cravată means tie. Cântecele means uh, songs. Then we have D, D, so D, this is Duminica, it's uh, Sunday, basically, Duminica, Dimineața, Devreme, Diana, Dormea, <laughs> this is, you, can, you can even make a, a sentence here, Duminica, Dimineața, Devreme, Diana, Dormea, everything with D, 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 D. Next is E, this is not E, this is E. E, elephant, energie, Elena, ero, evit, eșec. E, is our words pronounced like this, E. Next is F, so F, you can pronounce it F, so F, so F. It depends if you, for example, if you read A, B, C, D, E, F, G, you pronounce F, but Sometimes you can say fe. Floare. Fanel. This is nume. Fanel. Elena also is nume. Fericire. Happiness. Foarte. A lot. Fum. Smoke. Fructe. Floare. Fanel. Fericire. Foarte. Fum. Fructe. Yeah? So this is how f f Next is G. And then we have this G, yeah, the letter. Then we have these um, uh, combinations. J, this is how I pronounce J, G. And as like, an example, you have J, like Georgiana, Georgiana, and G, like Gergina, for example. And the uh, words will start with G are Gunoi, Grupa, Georgiana, Gard, Gdila. This is uh, Agdila is um, uh, to tickle, and guard means fence, and gunoi means garbage. Yeah, so g gunoi grupa guard gdila. These are by the way just some example. You don't have absolutely anything to do with anything. It's just they have just starting with some random words starting with letter G. You don't need to learn them or anything, but just you to hear me how I pronounce it. Next is h. Horia, this is a name. Hots, hotel, has. <laughs> Hydrant. E, this is E. Italia, iscusit, indifferent, icre, historia. Yeah, so we don't pronounce history, but we say historia, icre. Uh, yeah. Next is, it's called U din I. So you have this U from I. It's like the I with a hat. Like A was here, the hat. Now we have U din I. And you prom pronounce it U, yeah, the same. Unkid. Un means in. Umbracat. Unceapa. Umbarca. Unceput. U din These are words with U. This is J, Jos, Joy, Jura, Ajura, to swear, Jucarie, Jertfa, Junior. Next is K, K, this is Kappa, so Kappa, K, so Kappa, Ka, um, Kile, Kivi, Kilometru, Kenyan. The person from Kenya is Kenyan. Um, L, litera, litru, 
limbă, larg, limită, lingură. It's pretty simple, l. Um, m, mamă, maimuță, marcă, milion și mătură, mătură. N, uh, nimeni, nimic, ninja. Ninja, ninja, because we learned j here, jos, ninja, nervi, negru, nostalgie. Then we jump to o, o, it's very uh, sharp, o, it's not o, 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 it's o, o midă, oferă, uh, to, to offer, you know, o, ostaș, soldier, orange, Oameni. This o a is wa. Yeah. P. Pricina. Piscina. Pește. Porc. Pomana. Poi mâine. Yeah. It's the day after tomorrow. This is Q. Q. Yeah. Uh, there are not a lot of words here, so there are, I found just two. Quark and quasar. Quasar. So quark. Uh, next is R. Rădăcină, Roma, repetent, riguros, resistant. By the way, I'm, I'm saying this first letter a little more accentuated than I normally speak, so I won't say Roma, you know, but I, I just want you to hear how I say this R, you know. Normally I say rădăcină, Roma, repetent, riguros, resistant. Yeah, so, but I say repetent, so you know that this R, how it sounds. S, stele. Saturn, sport, seara, surpriză, spart, stana. And last, we're going closer to the end. This is, um, so you have here the S, yeah? Simple S, Stelis, Saturn, blah, blah. And now you have SH. This is an S with this small comma here. It's pronounced SH. Strengar, sharpe. Chosea, spagat, strand, scolar. Uh, I made a mistake here. I had to put this shoe, but I wrote S. I was in a hurry. Um, t, tata, țăran. Oi, sorry, clicked wrong. Tata, țăran, tractor, troleibuz, tramvai. Yeah? T. Next is the T with this small comma. It's ț, țeapă, țară, țintaș, țanțoș. It's like tz from English. And here, sh is like sh in English. This is not u, it's u. You remove the e in front of u. Univers, urzică, unealtă, usturoi, util, ultimul. Yeah? Ultimul, uh, the last. V. Asta nu e. V is V. Vineri, vânt, verdeață, virgulă, versuri, vraci, voltaj. So, um, yeah, vineri is the, the Friday in Romania. Then we have W. This is W. Yeah? W. W. Wolfram, West, Western. Um, Wolfram, Western, Watt. So this is how you re read it. W, Watt. Yeah, it's like a V. But V, you can make it a little stronger. Then you have X. Xylophone, Xerox. I really couldn't come up with the X. Xylophone and Xerox. This is where the only words that I could come up with. Then we have Y. This is not Y. It's Y. Y, yeah? Yen, Yoga. And the last letter in Romanian alphabet is Z. Yeah, Z, Z. Zero, zahar, zid, zona, zvon, zob. Okay, so uh, once again, I don't give you like 50 words here to, to learn them by any chance. Uh, I mean, you can, you know, Google them, but um, This lesson is more or less about um, how you will, um, you know, 
you, you see some letter and you know how to pronounce it. So it's it's you need to listen kind of a couple of times to to get to um, know the words, but and the the how they sound, you know, how the word how the first letter changes uh, the word. So for example, it's tsapa, tsapa, tsar, tsintar. Tsintsar, Tsantsosh. Yeah, so you need to listen a few times to to, to know how to um, pronounce it properly. And, you know, I can give you much, much more examples, but, you know, it's uh, beside the point. Except for this xylophone, it's like really hard to find words in Romanian with X. And some of them are so weird that I don't even know what they mean. So it doesn't matter. So, guys, thank you very much for listening to me and this lesson about alphabet. I hope it's uh, helpful for you. It's really a, just about pronunciation and to hear the words, um, you know, by a native for you guys. So thank you very much once again, and I wish you a wonderful uh, day ahead. Bye-bye. Hello everyone. Today's lesson is lesson number 21 from Romanian, uh, the Romanian with Vlad. So uh, today we'll speak about numbers. So let's start. Okay. So first of all, uh, we have to make the difference between numere și cifre. Yeah. So we have cifre from zero to nine and numbers from 10 and beyond. So um, when I say, for example, a four, uh, it's a um, patru, yeah? It's a cifra, yeah? So what do we say? 25, it's a number. So let's start with uh, the first one, which is zero. Zero, yeah? Zero. Zero, gra for, this is an example. Zero grade afară. So zero grade afară. There are zero uh, degrees outside. This is in, um, centi in um, Celsius, yeah? Then we have one, uno, un bayat o fata. You see, it's changing. For example, when I say the, uh, uh, the number itself, one, it can be, for example, one girl, one boy. It's always the same in English. But in Romanian, it's un bayat, because it's masculine, and o fata, one girl. So it changes the form. Um, doi, two, doi copii, two children. Do pisic, two cats. This is some example, of course. Three, trei. Uno, doi, trei. Trei culori are steagul României. Three colors has the Romanian flag. Trei culori are steagul României. Three colors, yeah? Four, patru. Doi plus doi face patru. You can say, for example, 2 plus 2 make equals 4. Um, 2 plus 2 face 4. 5 plus 3 face 8. No? 4 minus 2 face 2. Um, so results in, you know, 2 face. It's like creates, makes 4. Uh, next is 5. 5. 5 ani mai târziu. 5 years later. 5 ani mai târziu. 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Next is 6. A mâncat 6 clătite. He ate 6 pancakes. I can eat even more than that, but anyway. 7. 7. Are 7 ani de acasă. He has 7 years from home. Uh, means that he's, uh, let's say, educated. So he's not, you can say, for example, for, from a boy, he's, he's well behaved. So you can say, um, are 7, are 7 ani de acasă. He has some, some years in which the parents, um, uh, kind of educated, raised him, so he's not, you know, raised on the on the street. Eight, opt, opt, ora opt, Sarah, eight p.m. evening in the evening. Opt, no, no, yeah, no, no, cățeluș, beau lapte. Nine puppies were drinking milk, are drinking milk. And the last, zece. Zero, zece, yeah? <laughs> Some is very similar. Nota zece la purtare. Uh, it's ten grade at behavior. It sounds so weird. So basically, we have um, uh, a mark in school, a grade, uh, for uh, how well you behave. Normally, everybody has ten, which is the maximum. Um, but some, some people get uh, lower than that. depends on how they act. So nota zece la purtare. It means that you're, you know, Good, basically. 
Okay, uh, next page. Now I want to give you some examples of uh, how you create these longer um, numbers. So for example, 74, 74 și 4. This is how you say this in Romanian, 74, 156, 1324. So 74, 70, 7 tens, yeah, și 4, and 4, și, 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 și. You'll notice this she everywhere, and for 74. But you, when you uh, read it, normally you say 74, 74. So you get rid of this chi. So it make it more uh, natural. 156. 156 și 6. 156. 156. 100, five tens and six. This is how you kind of think about it. So you, you don't have, really have to translate it. You can actually translate this, you know. O suta, 100, 5, 6, 5, 5, tens and 6. O mie, 320 și 4. 1,300, 2 tens and 4. So, 7, 10, so tens are 10, yeah, because we learned that 10 is 10. 100 is o suta, suta. O 1000 is o mie, yeah, mie. And then from there onwards is 20 de mie, 20 mie, thousands, mi. Yeah? Plural from mie is mi, 20 de mie, 400, yeah, I just highlighted the last three zeros so you know that where it's ending, 400 de mie, yeah? 400 de mie de lei, for example. And this is like, it has one and uh, six zeros, so it's uh, one million. And, and so on, you know, zece milioane, o de milioane, un miliard. It's just ridiculous already, but uh, until here, it's, this is how you create them. Then you have the signs the, um, in the mathematics and algebra. So it's like adunare, it means plus, yeah, plus, plus, scădere, minus, minus, Înmulțire, ori, doi, doi ori doi, uh, two uh, or, or two, uh, two, um, <laughs> yeah, in this sign. Um, împărțire, this sign, yeah. you can write it or like this or like this, depends. Anul acesta este 2021, this year is 2021. La mulți ani. This is, <laughs> yeah, I just came up with some, some phrases related to, to numbers. Um, so you can say, for example, la mulți ani. It, can, it means, or in Romania, also happy new year. Um, so when you, when you change the year from 2020 to 2021 and beyond, um, you can say, for example, in the first day of the 1st of January, you can say la mulți ani, happy new year. And you can say the same thing, la mulți ani, when it's your birthday. Happy birthday, basically. Now, cât face 3 minus 1? How much is 3 minus 1? Cât face 3 minus 1? Yeah, you can replace cât face and then you can put cât face x minus uh, epsilon. Uh, aritmetică is arithmetic. Geometrie is geometry. Geometrie, yeah. Then there are the numbers. Uh, so there are numere naturale, which are, which are just, um, let's say, full. It's like 0, 1, 2, 3, and always positive. Then we have numere întregi, which are also negative, but also like they're full, so without any small things. Și numere reale, and which basically any number fits between minus infinite to plus infinite. So I'm just to give you some examples. And infinite means infinity. Yeah, it sounds you know, the same. And egal is equal. So, and this is this mathematical sign on the computer. Or, um, and how to pronounce from like beyond 10 until 20. So you have like unsprezece. This is unsprezece, yeah? Uno sprezece. One towards 10. Unsprezece. Doi sprezece. Trei sprezece. Pai sprezece. 15, 16, 17, 18, 19. So they are all kind of the same. You just put the number in front. 18. And then 20. 
20, yeah? then we start 21, 22, 23, and then this is some example, 541, 541, 101 uh, Dalmatians, 101 Dalmatians, 101 Dalmatians, and the last is zero, so you can say zero, nimic, you can say nimic, as well, but it's not really mathematic. Vid, like doesn't like no air, <laughs> and um, uh, goal, it's empty kind of. So you can say all this about the zero. Yeah. So guys, this is the lesson twenty one. Uh, it was a little short one uh, related to numbers, um, and I think I think I covered all. Um, I could have entered, you know, some more details about, um, you know, some equations and stuff, but yeah, I think this is enough for, for today, you know. Uh, I just wanted to make a pronunciation of, of those uh, numbers. So thank you uh, for watching and I wish you a pleasant day ahead. Bye-bye. Hi guys, good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Um, so today's lesson number 22. Um, this lesson is about plants. Um, and plant-related uh, topics. So uh, let's get started, like always. Okay, so uh, I will start with uh, some mm, things uh, which I am really thinking about when I think about uh, plants and, and flowers and trees and so on. So first is squarza de copac, the tree bark is the, the skin of the tree. Let's say um, you know is the rough one. Squarza de copac. The tree, copac means tree, and squarza means bark. Uh, copaci au florit, the trees blossomed. You know, the trees. You can call, for example, copac is a tree, and also uh, pom. Here, pomului, frunza pomului. So you can call tree uh, pom or copac. Um, copaci au florit, the trees blossomed in spring. Uh, primavara, copaci au florit in spring, the trees blossomed. Pisica se ascunde într-un tufiș. The cat is hiding in a bush. Tufiș is bush. Frunza pomului, the leaf of the tree. Or, um, frunza crengi, um, the leaf from the uh, twig, you know, the, the branch. Am, cump uh, am cumpărat feriga nou. I bought a new fern. Fern is feriga. Then pădure is forest. It's like, you know, the sum of the trees. Uh, all together, you can call them forest, pădure. Uh, flower is floare. I think we spoke already about it in another lesson. Uh, grădina is garden. Garden, grădina. Dumbrava is groove. Dumbrava. Plantele au crescut în alte. The plants grew tall. So you can say, for example, I watered the plants uh, in the garden and they all grew tall. Uh, am mudat plantele uh, în, um, în grădină și au crescut foarte în alte. Iedera. Ivy. You know, is this I plant which, which um, grows on, on, um, on buildings? Some buildings are very nicely uh, covered in uh, in this um, cloth of, of uh, ivy. And juniper, yanupar. This is like kind of specific. It's not you don't really need to learn it, but just hear it how it uh, it sounds. Yanupar, juniper. Împădure caut mușchi. In the forest, I'm looking for moss. Uh, have you ever been to the forest and uh, you saw this? mossy um, uh, part, patch of, of ground. Um, this is really this is called moss, it's called mushki. And mushki is also in Romanian uh, muscle, so just not to confuse them. And it's written the same, mushki. Veverita mănâncă nuci. The squirrel is eating nuts. This is like from Ice Age movie. Veverita mănâncă nuci. Yeah, nuci is nuts. Nuca is nut. Pe insulă sunt mulți palmieri. On the island are a lot of palm trees. Palmier is palm trees. Rădăcină, rut. Rădăcină, rădăcină. Pădure tropicală, rainforest. 
Yeah? Pădure tropicală, rainforest. Marea e plină de alge. The Black Sea, or Marea, the, the Marea Neagră, este plină de alge. The uh, Black Sea is full of seaweed. And, you know, it's kind of annoying if you want to swim. Um, am plantat niște puieți în grădină. I planted some saplings in the garden. Am plantat, I planted, yeah, some saplings, puieți, în grădină. So, which will become a tree later. Sămânță is the seed, the, the small, small uh, thing is uh, sămânță. Crenguță. Uh, is uh, Krenguza, uh, twig, and also Krenguza is also a name of, of a girl, Krenguza, twig, little little branch. Trandafirul era plin de gimbi. The rose was full of thorns. Trandafirul is rose, era plin, it was full of gimbi, gimbi, yeah, it's like a kind of uh, thorns. Vița de vie, vine. And last page, um, buruiana, weed. So we can say, for example, that um, this field is full of weeds. Um, acest teren este plin de buruien, buruieni. Am mudat grădina cu stropitoarea. I watered the garden with a watering can. Trebuie să tunzi iarba cu mașina. With a, yeah, you have to cut the grass with a grass cutting machine. Trebuie să tunzi iarba cu mașina. Primavara apar muguri. In spring, buds appear. So you can see them through, through sometimes through the eyes, you know, popping up. Uh, buchet de flori, flower bouquet. So you can give to someone you love, to your mother, or to, to your, you know, love uh, uh, bouquet of flowers. Buchet de flori. Vacile stau pe o pășune. The cows are on a pasture. Pășune, pasture. Vacile is cows. Yeah. Vaca is singular for cow. Greble, and this is like some, some tools from, from the garden. Greble, rake. Yeah, is this um, stick with, with like pins at the end so you can like uh, make some small, small uh, holes in the ground and move it along. Quasa, quasa, sith, quasa. It's like the, the symbol of. Um, Um, the death, you know, the, the seed coming to, to take your soul. Um, fertilizator, fertilizer. It's kind of similar. Green is lily. It's this uh, plant which smells very, very strong at, at night. So you don't sleep with it in the same room because it can, uh, you know, affect you. You'll definitely have some, some uh, uh, dreams. Um, or in, Next is lalea, tulip. So a lot of people will say, ah, lalea is, sounds like lily. It's, it's very similar, but actually crin is a lily and lalea is tulip. You know, imagine uh, Holland, Netherlands, uh, full of tulips, very colorful and beautiful. So guys, lesson 22 is over. Um, yeah, well, this was about plants, uh, not in particular about flowers. So I wanted everything related to You know, garden forest um, and um, I, I think I covered some things maybe if I miss something please let me know um, and we can I can make an updated version of this video but anyway until next time thank you very much for listening and have a nice